I'm building a coil coax balm for 70 mix 4 meters. The coax I'm using is RG58, very old stuff, AU. Velocity factor 0 0.66 50 ohms. The balm will be half wavelength long. There's the measurements point sorry 4.57 feet 139 meters three turns RG213 is actually 1.40 meters a little bit more difficult to bend I'm sure this short length will not make a difference to your loss in your coax length to the radio. As close as you can to the antenna. Hopefully this will help in stopping your coax from radiating like mine. I've made a marker on a flat surface so that's the, the beginning on my rough tape. Seen some work, and there is 600. Sorry, four, six, three millimeters for one of the coils. I've divided that half wavelength into three and I'm going to mark each three separately so the line up and the coil is perfect or as near as you can. Mark a sticky label, wrap it round your first part of measuring, mark it like that and then stretch the coax out to the to the right to your next mark two fingers like this without holding the camera hold it firmly down and with your sticky label positioned around the coax in the right place mark it with the pen do that twice so you will end up three of these at 463 mil apart actually <clears throat> there will be four marked out but you will only be tie wrap you, you will tie wrapping the four together here where one will be on one outside to the antenna and the other outside will be the extra length going to join to back to your radio maybe it's joined onto a 213 so these four will be tie wrapped together make sure they are parallel to each other not too tight first and then you will be going around and tie wrapping the three together. Very carefully. So no extra tightness yet. You will find that putting it in between your legs and moving it around you will be able to put the tire up so much easier. Just loosely at the moment of course, so you get them all round you will need quite a few tire wraps to make it secure. Right, it's taking shape now, make sure you keep going around like this and make sure they're parallel to each other these will tend to jump out 
because the four wide is just how it is but you've got the idea there look just keep keep pressing it pressing them flat and, and popping um, I'm going to go around with more tie wraps in between these tie wraps but you've got to keep it keep them straight parallel to each other keep pressing the middle pops out a bit pops down you've got to keep pushing it up and sometimes it goes down but once you've got all the tie wraps with no gaps like that the next tie wrap will will take that up don't you you don't want to be squashing <coughs> the coax just enough pressure to hold them together while they're up on the your antenna well there it is I do believe the lubric the sticky label for marking was a bad idea so it does give it some lubrication to to slip and collapse on itself where there is where there is four coax tie wrap together they are they still work okay the rest is fine look plenty of tie wraps no gaps But this is old, old school coax, maybe 20 odd years old, and it's got a shiny surface on it, soft surface. As you see, it's a rubberized type surface. It will do for this, but the, the new coax has got a non-slippy type surface, and it should hold together pretty good. Don't go buying one of these when you can make them yourself it does help if you've got a gun tie wrap gun I've, like many, I've had this many years 73 best of luck see you on 40 <laughs> on 4 meters <laughs> we're trying the coax balm I've just built for a good quality dummy load to show you that there is no change or will be no change from your antenna SWR through this coax or ballon to your radio so here we are and we're already on setting for 70 megs we'll go right round there's no no movement of us so from a, from a one to one is there we'll go up up to uh, two meters just a little bit of rise there did you see the the needle go up there just a little bit of rise of of the needle all right here we go look it's going look so not too good for two meters but we're not bothered about two meters we'll get back onto we're on 70 megs all right good to go on 70 megs i should think most other parts of the frequency spectrum is there look even 50 megs. 
further down so I should think 1.82 70 max that's the uh, that's the end yep okay not a good idea the sticky tape sticky labels, oh, it's collapsing but should be okay I guess. <laughs>